There are some three-dimensional figures that are not polyhedrons. This is because at least one of their faces is not a polygon. One 3D figure that is not a polyhedron is a cylinder. A cylinder is a solid figure. It has two congruent and parallel circular bases, and it has one curved lateral face. On a cylinder, we can measure its dimensions as the radius of our circular base and the height of our cylinder. When we take our cylinder and flatten it into its net, we can see that we have our two circular bases and its curved lateral face actually flattens out into one large rectangle. Another three-dimensional figure that is not a polyhedron is a cone. A cone is a solid figure, it has one circular base, and a curved lateral face that meets at an apex. On a cone, when we go to measure its dimensions, we can measure its radius, we can measure the actual height of the cone, and then we can also measure the slant height of the lateral face. When we take our cone and flatten it into a net, we can see our one circular base, and then along our lateral face, we can see the curved edge where it joins with the base. A third three-dimensional figure that is not a polyhedron is a sphere. A sphere is a solid figure. It's perfectly round like a ball. It does not have any separate faces, and all points are an equal distance from its center. The only dimension we really need to worry about measuring is its radius. From the radius, we can find the height, and height and diameter are the same on the sphere. However, another part of the sphere that we should take note of is called the great circle. The great circle of the sphere is the circumference of the sphere around its widest part. For the net of a sphere, it's difficult to flatten one and keep all lengths, angles, and areas the same. Where we most often see an attempt at a net of a sphere is when we're trying to look at the map of the Earth instead of at a globe.